Well, today, the president of Helen DeVos Children's Hospital addressed concerns on the rising number of flu cases that they're seeing. While flu cases are up, there's a promising trend with another virus that's been making its rounds. News 8's digital host Phil Panarski joins us from the live desk with more on what the hospital is seeing right now. Phil? Emily and Sue, just last week alone, the hospital saw 160 patients test positive for the flu, which is higher than in previous years. Dr. Hossein Mirandi, the president of the hospital, says that Thanksgiving gatherings likely played a role in that spike, along with fewer flu shots being administered. RSV cases are down at the hospital, but the influx of flu cases has kept the hospital staff busier than ever before. We have seen significant numbers over the last few weeks. Uh, we believe that we reached a peak last week. Uh, the most number of patients that we had had in-house uh, at Helen DeVos Children's Hospital with these viruses. Uh, it was the largest uh, uh, number of volume patients that we have had, and we saw that across the board in both our ICUs as well as our floors. Now, despite the record number of in-house patients, Dr. Mirandi wants to ensure parents that the hospital is prepared to care for any child that needs treatment for the flu, RSV, or COVID. At the live desk, Phil Panarski, News 8.